Also topping your news this half hour in a bold move, a Michigan judge has blocked the week's old ban on flavored e-cigarettes. Yeah, and this morning, vape shops, they are restocking their shelves, and Governor Whitmer is asking the state's highest court to step in. 13 on your side to Angela Cunningham, joining us now live with the latest. Angela? Kristen and James, that court of claims judge issued a preliminary injunction yesterday to stop the ban until an existing lawsuit is settled. This morning, the governor is calling that move reckless, considering what many call a public health emergency. Now, you may recall last month, Michigan became the first state to ban the sale of flavored e-cigarettes. This after U.S. health officials rang the alarm about the dangers of teen vaping. Now, to date, the CDC reported reports nearly 1,300 cases of lung injury and 26 deaths associated with e-cigarette use. Several vape shops have filed lawsuits saying Michigan's emergency ban will harm or ruin their businesses. Judge Cynthia Stevens agreed, saying the ban could irreparably hurt vaping businesses and force adults to return to smoking more harmful tobacco products. We're pretty excited about it. Obviously, it's news we've been waiting for for a while. I think what the governor is doing is pretty wrong to basically shut down all these small businesses that are just trying to help people stay off cigarettes. Now, the judge says she believes the businesses suing the state could likely prevail because of how the state enforced the ban. Since Michigan's ban went into effect, at least five other states have banned the sale of flavored vaping products. Now, Michigan's attorney general plans to appeal the judge's injunction directly before the state Supreme Court. We will follow this story and bring you developments as they happen. For now, back to you.